Hi friends, welcome to Tamil Marine Aquarium. Uh, this time I am going to post a video about adding a demo switch to our lights. The primary reason why I am adding a demo switch to our light is because there are three main reasons why I am using it. One is I can increase or decrease the light brightness. Second one is it will increase the uh, lifetime of the uh, LED chip. Third one is it is really very cost effective one and it will uh, reduce the power consumption. Fourth one is it is easily upgradable. For example, I have added a manual uh, dimmer. Maybe in future I can upgrade it with uh, Wi-Fi dimmer or a remote control dimmer uh, based upon the availability. Maybe in future I will uh, post an update about this. Uh, the main reason why I am uh, uh, posting is because uh, I have already mentioned this in uh, my uh, previous DIY lights video. I am really very thankful to each and every person that have watched uh, the uh, DIY lights. Uh, many guys have contacted me uh, how to make a light. I think I have uh, guided them uh, the shops and uh, the uh, uh, heat sink things and uh, every uh, possible things that I can help. I am really very helpful and thankful to all those who contacted me. Uh, further, uh, if you uh, guys didn't watch that video and you are new to this channel, I think you should watch the DIY lights. Many uh, uh, persons have now came up with uh, DIY things. I am really very happy that they are able to do on their own. And certain people have asked that, uh, can you uh, uh, sell those DIY lights uh, to those, those friends? I am uh, really uh, regretting that. My main aim is to make a DIY light and you have to do things on your own so that it will be really very cost effective one and we can grow this hobby effectively. Uh, the uh, dimmer what I have chosen now is an manual dimmer uh, with uh, DC current of 12 to 24 volt and 8 amps. My uh, DC uh, driver is 24 volt and uh, 5 amps as I have already told in my DIY lights. So that's the reason why I have chosen this one. I think the 24 volt by amps falls between, between this range as you see in the uh, image. So uh, let's uh, get into the video friends. I'll show you how to connect the uh, dimmer uh, with our LED lights. Thank you. So uh, this is the dimmer I was referring to friends, it's a manual dimmer, what I have done is I have used the silicone uh, gel to, to stick it with the light. Uh, this is the 24 volt 5 amps AC driver that I am using for my DIY lights. I have, uh, I am going to give the uh, output of the driver into the input of dimmer, from the dimmer I will be giving it to the lights. So as I already said uh, this is the uh, wire. I have already marked the uh, negative and positive diodes. Uh, for example, the black is uh, negative as I already marked it. And I have given the uh, connection to input of the dimmer. Next goes the output. So uh, I have already marked while uh, creating the DIY lights. So the blue color represents, represents the uh, positive and the black color represents the negative. Uh, since while making the light, I already did it. So let's uh, te test it and see if it is working or not. So I'm going to switch on the uh, light, I mean the uh, driver. Let's test it friends. So I'm going to increase the brightness so as you see. It is an uh, 12 noon after 12 noon and the uh, intensity of the light is really very extraordinary. Now it is under the full output of uh, the light. So this is a uh, morning view. Uh, let's also see the uh, view in the night. I think it should be very bright than the morning. So this is my uh, final output friends uh, in the night view. So I think this is even bright enough uh, than what we say, uh, saw in the morning. So I hope you guys like my video. Uh, thank you friends. My next video will be uh, why we need to use a refractometer instead of hydrometer. Uh, I'll, show, I'll make a separate video for that friends. I hope you like my uh, videos. Please like, share and subscribe my channel friends. Thank you.